Hello, this is Mrs. Bobby, and we are going to look at mixed fractions to improper fractions and improper to mixed fractions. So here we have a mixed number that we're going to be making into an improper fraction. Now there's a process that we want to do here. We're going to take this denominator, we're going to multiply it by the whole number, and we're going to add the numerator, and we're going to get a whole new numerator. So let's do that first. 5 times 5 is 25, plus 3, my 6, my 7, 28. And we keep our original denominator. And that's a mixed number into an improper fraction. So let's look at this one. Denominator multiplied by the whole number. Add the numerator. 42, 43, 44 over the denominator originally given. Denominator times the whole number, add the numerator. So we got 72, 75, 76, 77 over the original denominator. Another way to look at this is we could say bottom times the side, add the top, and put it all back over the bottom. That's a little kid language. Now, let's do the complete opposite of that. Move the dot cam down. We're going to take an improper fraction, and we're going to make it into a mixed number. Now, some kids can see it right off. They say, how many denominators go into the numerator? So how many fives in 12? And we can see that we can go in two times to make 10. Well, we're thinking this little number that I'm writing right here. So like 5 times 2 made 10. What's left over? A 2 and the denominator of 5. Another way of looking at this is to make it a division problem. The numerator is inside the division box, which is the dividend, and the denominator is the divisor. And how many 5s are in 12 is 2. 5 times 2 is 10. We subtract. We get 2 leftovers, and there's our answer. 2 and 2 fifths. That's where the 2 is, and then this is the fraction part, 2 fifths. Okay, how many sixes go into 29 without going over? Well, we know five of them gives us 30, but that's too many, so 24. We think this little number that I'm putting here, what's left over, is five, denominator, six. If we have to sh do the math, six goes into 29 four times, makes 24. Left over is five, four, and five, six. Four, five, six, four, five, six. Nine, how many nines in 48? Five makes 45. Leftovers, three, nines. We could reduce that if asked. 48 divided by nine. Five and three, nines. And as always, I heart math and Diet Coke and tea.